Hey everyone, welcome to another video. As always, my name is Jay, and in this video I'm going to talk about my New Year's resolutions for 2019. I wanted to make this video a little while ago, but I've been having some issues with my right eye. As you can probably see, it's a little off. Uh, so I've been taking a break from making videos for a little bit, um, but that's okay. So I figured I might as well talk about my New Year's resolutions. Every year, you know, we come up with New Year's resolutions and we try to follow them. And this year I've come up with a few. And my goal for my New Year's resolutions is to make sure that every one of my goals is measurable, realistic, and obtainable. You know, I, I really think... I don't want, uh, I'm going to push myself, but I'm not going to say, you know, I'm going to put out 500 videos this year or reach 100,000 subscribers. It's probably not going to happen. I'm going to try my best to make as many videos as possible, and I'd love to get to 100,000 subscribers this year, but it probably won't happen. So, um, for my channel, my goals are pretty easy. Um, I'm going to try to be putting out 150 videos this year. That's my goal. So 150 videos, I already put out a couple so far this year, and I really got to catch up because now it's mid-January and I have to put out more videos. But that's okay, because you know what, I'm going to do a, a painting with Jay every week. So that's a third of it right there. And amongst my videos, I am going to try to get some more um, series going. I would love to do an Orc Tactica series, or a Tyranid Tactica series, or a Granite Tactica series. Um, three armies that I do have the majority of the models for... The armies, you know, I'd, I'd be able to cover most of the models. And um, those are some series I really like to do. Also, I'd really like to get uh, Q&J or uh, Miniature Painting 101, both of them off the ground again. So I'll be posting new videos, asking for some suggestions in the near future as well. Um, I'm going to keep doing my, you know, some painting tutorials, moving them from the warp as well, and putting out some new ones. So, as I said, there's a plethora of content that I still have available, and I think 150 videos, which averages out to just under three videos a week, being 52 weeks, um, is a realistic value. I really do think it is. Um, I know a lot of channels will be putting out a lot more content, but you know what? I have a full time job, and I think that's realistic um, for my channel. I'd also really love to see if I can get to, um, I just crossed 5 million views. Um, I'd really love to cross 40,000 subscribers this year, see if, you know, if I can just top that and it'd be awesome. I think by putting up more regular content, it would be a, um, I think it'd be a much more realistic goal. As I said, it's only, you know, only a few thousand more subscribers away from that. Based on my average number of subscribers increase per month, I think that's realistic and I'd like to keep going from there. Uh, I don't know if I'd be able to get a million views to get to six million. That'd be pretty cool. But according, I'm going to keep putting out as much content as possible. Um, I'd really like to see if I can get a live show going as well. It doesn't look like the internet at my house is good enough, but I'm going to try it out at least once or twice and see how the reactions go. And that way I can actually, you know, actually in, uh, interact with you guys in live, um, in live time. It'd be really cool. You know, it would be very cool to, um, to be able to do that. What else? Um, on the on my personal side, of course, there's always, you know, get in better shape, pay off some debts, um, enjoy life a little bit more. I, as far as my hobby goes, um, I would really like to paint every model that I have. Kidding. Um, as I said, I want to be realistic. This year, I'm going to paint all my orcs. That's the, the first thing I think that's going to be very obtainable. I do have about four or five months more of orc painting ahead of me, probably based on a realistic time frame. And then some orky terrain as well. So I'll be painting orcs probably until the middle of the summer, and then I'll go from there. Um, after that, I'll probably quickly finish up my Grey Knights. I only have, you know, a, a few models left to paint up for my Grey Knights. And then work on the next army that I fancy, Imperial Knights, or Admech, or... Um, I'm done Necrons, I'm pretty much done Tyranids, um... Orcs will be done, so maybe Space Marines. I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna just call that in a few months, in six months, when I'm whenever I'm feeling, uh, I'm gonna paint. You know, the key is for the next five or four or five months at least, I'm gonna be painting orcs, and that's okay. Painting orcs and getting rid of orcs off my table is gonna take a huge amount of the unpainted models out of my world, and it's really cool. So uh, I'm currently just finished up a, a war trike. I'm gonna paint a. Uh, Another buggy first, and then I'll start painting all my trucks, including that new truck that I got from Ian. I, I really do appreciate it. And then paint, paint a bunch of boys, paint some Bernas, paint a battle wagon, keep going from there. You know, world is my oyster. 
but that's my goal. Get orcs off my table and then start there. As I said, if I keep making a painting with Jay and dedicate about, I'm going to try to do an hour a day. Lately, it's been hard. My right eye has been really uh, messed and um, I haven't been able to see uh, purely out of it for, uh, see perfectly out of it for a little while. So I haven't painted as much as I hoped, but I'm, I'm hoping to get back on track. And as I said, I've done my war trike. And since starting to paint orcs already, I've painted a significant amount of orcs, so I'm going to keep going with that. So that's basically it, and I want you guys to keep me accountable. I'm going to keep these videos going. In fact, I was thinking kind of cool just to number the videos that I'm putting out. Now, the other thing is I will be trying to get my Patreon back off the ground. I would really like to get that thriving again. Um, it is a fraction of what it once was, so I'll be talking about that as well. And I know I don't like talking about money and, and people don't like hearing it, but that's okay too. So I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep my videos coming. As I said, 150 videos this year I think is a realistic goal. This is video like number two or three of the year. Oh, of which I also want to put out 20 battle reports. I should mention that as well. My goal for this year is 20 battle reports. So on average, one every two. I would love about 25, 26, so one every two weeks. I already have about three or four filmed uh, so far that I want to be putting out. And so they'll be really fun. Um, involving orcs. It's going to be a lot of fun. And um, one involving Grey Knights, so it'll be cool there. So it's going to be a lot of fun. As I said, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep having fun. Uh, as far as conventions this year, I'm definitely going to Adepticon. I'm going to see about Gen Con. I haven't yet decided about it. Adepticon is my more preferred one. Gen Con, not as much because it's so big and Wargaming is such a tiny component of it. But uh, we'll see. We'll see. So those are my goals. So as a professionally, uh, and then also, also, like, professionally, my goals were is to, is to get one more promotion this year, and I'll... I think I should be able to obtain that as well. Uh, personally, I'm going to try to get in better, a little better of shape. I've been cutting out certain things on my diet lately, and I've been feeling better about it. Um, I also want to yeah, pay off a, a little bit of debt, uh, get in better shape, lose a little bit of weight. That's always good. I'm giving up sugar a lot. I'm giving up a lot of unnecessary sugars, um, which is good, too. I've been, I have been stopped buying pop for my house, or as my American friends call it, soda. And I've been cutting out a lot of snacks. Now, the only thing is about Christmas time was um, Christmas is obviously the time of junk food. Um, and I got a lot of sugary stuff for Christmas. So my girlfriend and I have kind of eaten through it. Um, and now we've kind of cut ourselves off cold turkey for the last couple weeks. And it's been great. You know what? I'm, I'm, not as, I'm definitely not consuming anywhere near as much sugar as I was before. That's my first thing I want to cut out is, is a lot of unnecessary sugar because, yeah... I'm trying to take better care of my teeth as well and um, of myself. And it's a great way to start when you have an, an eye problem. Now, it is just a, a yeah, it's all good. But uh, as you can see, it looks pretty funny. Um, my videos, as I said, I want to keep going with my videos. I want to keep just killing it. And, and I think 150 videos is a realistic goal. I think 20 to 25 battle reports is a realistic goal. And I'm going to keep doing codex reviews and some unboxings and reviews there. I'm going to be um, I'm going to come out with some merchandise this year, a little bit of merchandise. I don't know if I'll be actually selling it to people. I don't think so. I'll probably just come out and maybe give it away to some people and give it away to my Adepticon friends. But I'll definitely come out with some merchandise in the near future, um, i.e. I'm coming out with designs for some of it right now. Patreon people will know about it soon because I tell them uh, in some pre-updates. Um, and yeah, I'm going to paint some orcs and have a good year of painting. This is not going to, probably not going to be the year I've in my world of unpainted models, but actually next year could be. 2020, um, the way, rate that I'm going, I think I could hit this year alone, I think I can finish up my orcs, my gray knights, and my space marines. If I, if I dedicated to those three specifically, I think I can hit them all. And then that would just leave a couple side armies and some stuff. So I think it'd be a really realistic goal to have it everything done in 2020 and start paying. Like if I bought a new box of stuff, I can paint it instantly with no guilt. We'll see. So, what are your re New Year's resolutions? Let's keep each other on track. And I'm going to be doing some monthly updates. And then I'm thinking about that. Maybe a monthly update video every month. To talk about each of my goals and how I'm in close and what I'm doing on them. If I'm getting close, what I need to do to accomplish these, what I need from you. You know. And I think that'd be a really cool video series of my New Year's resolutions for this year. Focus on 2019 as a great year of accomplishing these goals. Uh, but most importantly as well, what are your goals? Let's talk about them in the comment section down below and let's discuss our goals and keep each other accountable. It'd be really cool. What are your goals? Are you trying to rid your world of pain models this year? That'd be a great goal. Um, yeah. So stay tuned for a lot more videos, a lot more content. I'll look, I think this is going to be a good year. I really do think so. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm, uh, I'm f already f kind of figuring out my year as far as my trips go and my plans. So it's gonna, I think it's going to be a really good year. 
And I hope you all have an amazing year ahead of you as well. So stay tuned for more videos. As always, this video is brought to you by my Patreon campaign. Link in the description below if you want to help support my videos and all those Patreon supporters. As you can see, their names go by my head. It's because then that I can keep focusing on these free content videos. So stay tuned for more videos. Texan is Jay saying, happy painting and happy 2019.